frequently asked question, what happens if there's a hurricane? How are you going to assure me that these solar panels on my roof are not going to blow away if the next Superstorm Sandy comes about? Well, I can tell you that everything we do is regulated by the Florida Building Code, and it's also regulated by um, the ASCE, uh, which also, which what they do is they, uh, they're the ones that create the, the wind, maximum wind speeds for specific areas in Florida. So for example, in Miami, um, there's going to be a much higher wind load requirement down there than versus Orlando. Um, of course, Miami being a coastal uh, city. So um, we're governed by those two bodies plus any local municipality. They all require us to over-engineer everything that we do. So all the stuff that we're putting on your roof, solar panels, rails, all the attachments are rated for over 180 mile an hour winds. And just a little bit on hurricanes, if you've ever seen 180 mile an hour hurricane winds, you're going to be worried about a lot more than just your solar panels. You better hope that your house is uh, going to stand up. So hope that helps.